So, so this also looks like a patron list because of the inner age. Well, Tempo runs a similar build as well, but yeah, inner age, inner age does as well. say patron. Yeah. Uh, there is also Worgen, Raging Worgen. Oh yeah, that's true too. Oh yeah, there's uh, Ooh, it's the Raging, Raging, Raging Worgen. Yeah, it's definitely Raging Worgen. But the, both of these uh, are kind of kind of t um, like combo decks in general. Like with the, uh, <laughs> the full combo in hand now. Holy oh, wait, crap! So he could potentially win on what turn six. Oh, turn five with the coin if he yeah. get his opponent low enough before that point, which he's yeah. tapping, so there is possibilities. Yeah, so Nasum really needs to know what this deck is early, just so he can set up his taunts, just so he doesn't get punished. Well, like yeah, punished by That's this probably, combo early. Yeah, that. yeah. Shadow Bolt. Yeah, yeah, Shadow Bolt. Without a thought, Shadow Bolt. Yeah, you don't want him to draw that much. But two combo pieces already in hand. That's actually quite just three now. Holy crap! <laughs> Ooh, so that wait, probably wouldn't. Can you play like on turn five combo. too? Yeah, probably. Yeah, he probably wouldn't expect like an early combo. He probably will start tapping each so every turn. A war axe next turn could potentially end the game. Yeah. If he doesn't pull a taunt or uh, Reno Jackson self yeah. full first like that damage. Mm. <laughs> but like Emperor on turn six seems way better than Emp uh, the uh, Reno Jackson. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he did not top deck the war axe, so there is no. Uh, are you confused? I say BGH on curve. <laughs> BGH on curve. Well, what is he BGHing, dude? Absolutely nothing. nothing. Exactly. Phrase Worshipper is way better here. And yeah, you attack Phaser 4. You're still not even sure what variant of where you're playing against. Wow, how much damage? Planning. Or... Oh, I forgot about charge as well. That's uh, 26. Oh, 20, oh, 26. Holy, 26 from turn 8. That's disgusting. So he does decide to use the inner age first as we get rid of this taunt without using too much resources. This actually gives a lot of information. Like, yeah, I'm not does. a temple warrior. I'm uh, potentially something else. So yeah, he's going to go with the um, inner age this turn. Yeah. This is this definitely gives a lot of information because he doesn't, like, if he was any I mean, kind right, of... Sorry. Yeah, if he was any kind of temple warrior, he wouldn't... He wouldn't like spend so much resources just to remove the taunt right away, like he he could have waited. Ooh, he picked up Warax though, mm -hmm. which means he could start pushing for lethal. Mm -hmm. And he's only two turns away. Yeah. Well, no, he he's three turns away. I was yeah. An another forgetting that he doesn't have one anymore. Yeah. Another card that BB Gun really needs is Execute, because this Drake, when taunted up, it's gonna be pretty hard to get past. So that's if it gets taunted up. You do. Yeah. True. I Reno think it's more likely. Okay, we're gonna see Dark Peller come down looking for Mortal Coil, right? Mm -hmm. That's like best value. Oh, Acidic Swampus. That's a good pickup too. Corruption. Ooh. Okay, Boar is just as good as Mortal Coil in this situation. Mm -hmm. Or you could just leave with the Disciple. But yeah. Yeah. Boar is okay. Oh, maybe he's trying to go for Boar for um like, however overwhelming with uh well now Shadow Flame combo. Oh yeah, true, so, true. That's still board clear. Because you still don't know if this is patron or not. Yeah. Alright, 24. So one mana off from the actual combo itself to actually burst him down. <laughs> you would be lethal. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. It's, it's so close. It's just so close. So then Warax is going to take out a creature? Yeah, yeah. take out so, Peddler. So, yeah, so he's... I guess, like, BB Gun is trying to be, like, a little sneaky, I guess. Like, if he goes for phase, like... Probably not. Oh no, as soon as he plays it. the loot loot hoarder, he should know that it's Raging Morgan. Because of the only deck that's actually playing it. Yeah. So if he does not play <laughs> if he does not play Sunfairy Protector, he's dead, right? No, he did no, no, play no, no, an inner rage. No no, 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 so, yeah, he, he did play inner rage, so he's still missing damage. Um Nossum needed to tap in order for lethal, I think. No, yeah, he, he actually just needs multiple turns or Emperor. So there's three, there's two, that's six. Five. Yeah, six. Four. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, there's 22. If Nasum tapped there, he would have been dead. That's like, true, Emperor, that's true. every turn, he just hurt so much. Mm -hmm. What Nasum really needs to do is just taunt up, in my opinion. It looks like he might go with the execute on Emperor. Mm -hmm. Pretty good call, right? Yeah, pretty good call. So, what? We're going to see Ooze trade in, smack yeah. for four, probably play Sylvanas, and. Uh, does that change anything? No, it doesn't. No, 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 it does not. He can tap now, just because he will be um, taunting mm. Or Reno. Yeah, Reno and then Tampa, taunt up. <laughs> so he, he knows what he's playing against. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he knows what he is playing against. 
He also know how much damage his opponent actually has, like the uh, <gasps> kind of possibilities. Okay. Let's say. So now Emperor is needed from BB to find lethal. Still doesn't have Emperor. BB, please. Commanding show. All right. Yeah, just start getting the draw engine go. Oh! Oh, but he's one mana short now. Oh boy. Yeah, he, I think he's thinking about how he's gonna do this. Like, how much damage he could possibly do. But like, you need eleven mana for that charge and mm -hmm. <laughs> the uh, Worgen plus faceless. Mm -hmm. so. Ooh, faceless. Oh, faceless of his own. That that's true. It's... Just in case he can actually bypass through one of them. Or, like maybe like one Worgen goes through. Uh, Savannah's can actually help out a lot. I think you 100% played the board though. Mm -hmm. I have no time for games. Is there a world where he doesn't have to uh, taunt? There, there's a world that this Worgen deck might actually play Brawl. Because I did play against a deck that ran Brawl. I mean, yeah, we keep seeing multiple turns where there's absolutely nothing on the Worgen yeah. side, right? Yeah. So there might be a Brawl kind of tech in. So that's maybe one of the ways that Nassim will lose. But looking at this kind of board state, he's looking pretty good right now. Because he just doesn't have enough mana in time. Mm -hmm. So not even execute saves him here. Mm -hmm. Something about this deck is that if you know what deck it is, like early on, it's pretty easy to play around. Eh, just yeah, scanning all the damage. Yeah, but like this, like the Worgen deck in general really relies on your opponent, um, like kind of misleading them into what kind of deck it actually is and play it incorrectly, play against it incorrectly to actually win that way too. Like there's advantage of doing that.